So we have SMB segment attractiveness for UPS. Um, we have the y-axis is, is margin per parcel. Um, the range here is three to seven dollars, much higher than the Amazon profit margin per parcel. <laughs> um, and then we have the x-axis shows volume potential in millions of parcels per year. And then the bubble size is current parcel volume. So it looks like um, that would be less than the x-axis is what we would expect. Okay, so that's what we have. Looking at the chart, I see we have um, six different bubbles that are industries on these different accesses. Okay, so when I look at this, the customer segments that appear most attractive to me are this BTC e-commerce brand segment. That's a super large bubble and kind of, you know, $5 profit margin per parcel, which is much higher per Amazon. So it seems like this would be an attractive segment to go get. Um, secondary kind of segments to go get would be larger bubbles. So specialty food and beverage, subscription boxes, and local retailers. Why I focus on larger bubbles is I think these are all more profitable than Amazon. That's like not from the y-axis. If we have 950 million of parcel volume uh, to serve, like where can we, how can we fill that gap? And so to me, the larger bubbles would be more attractive than some of pharmaceutical distributors. That's a small bubble, but way more margin. Um, I think when we think about balancing the two, we're already achieving margin. So how can we achieve volume? So looking at this two priorities, one is clearly this DTC e-commerce. Secondary would be the next largest bubbles, which are specialty food, beverage, subscription boxes, and local retailers. I think taking a step back, when I look at this though, and I look at the bubble sizes, the largest bubble is 90 million parcels, which is about the size of DTC, which is one-tenth of the volume we're doing with Amazon. So while they're all way more profitable, I think we may struggle to fill the gap that Amazon is serving here from a volume standpoint. Amazon does like almost a billion packages per year. They're each about 20 cents. So they're getting 200 million-ish of profit. But if we look at 200 million parcels for DTC at $5 of profit, that's a billion. And so again, this goes to my point, we're gonna struggle to fill the volume, but we're gonna achieve higher profit.